Hi guys and welcome back. So today we are with Mr. James Haskell. For those of you abroad who may not know who he is, he is our international rugby star. So that's basically NFL but without the pads. So I'm going to pass it over to James and he's going to tell you what he's taking us through today. Thank you guys. Can I just say it's a great pleasure to be here with such two dashingly handsome oh, chaps. Thanks. Standard. Um, I'm liking the tight t-shirts yeah. as well. We've all got the memo. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're all wearing the same size. Promise. <laughs> yeah, 100%. Mine came in a can, I sprayed it on. <laughs> So what I'm going to do here today is take the guys from the Lean Machine through a rugby style session. For those of you at home, this is a session designed perfectly for focus on mobility and strength. Now these guys look like they can handle it, we shall see. We shall see. Okay guys, so this session is focused on mobility and strength. We're going to have a varying degree of rep ranges, so the first exercise we're going to focus on is squats. These are simple back squats. Now again, as always, making sure your feet shoulder width apart, the weight going through your heels to start with keeping it a nice straight back and tight abs. For this rep range, we're gonna do five reps and four sets of this exercise. Now the next exercise we're going to go in this superset is a leg extension. I'm a big fan of supplementary exercises, making sure that the resistance profile is continuous all the way through the movement. So you've got the back squat, where you've got a nice 3, 2, 1 count on the way down and one exploding up. Here with the leg extension, we're going to make sure we're going to do 10 reps of this. We do it nice and slowly, keeping resistance on the whole way through the movement. The next exercise we're going to do is a Romanian deadlift or an RDL. Now this exercise is focused on your hamstrings and your posterior chain. So the idea of the movement is to lower the weight, keeping a good back posture, feeling all the tension through your hamstrings. Now when you get to the point where you might lose your posture or your back's beginning to bend, you come back up with a really good hip drive like you're doing a hand clean or a normal clean. And at the top of that movement, you tense your buttocks, making sure you've got a good bit of power through your glutes and then you repeat the movement. We're looking to do this 10 times, three sets. Okay, on the theme of posterior chain and supersetted with our RDLs is double leg hip thrusters. With the hip thrusters, the whole focus is again through your glutes, making sure you've got good stability. So what you're doing, you have a weight across your waist, your shoulders on a bench. You're making sure you get a good range of movement. So you're trying to touch your bum to the floor, and as you come up, you're aggressively uh, driving your hips up, using your glutes at the top. You hold the movement, and you come back down. Again, we're looking to do 10 reps of this, three sets. Drop it. Okay, the next exercise we're going to do is coming away from the legs. It's focusing on a little bit of upper body, looking at some strength, looking at opening up your shoulders. We're going to do a V-sit pull-up. Now, the idea is to get a full extension of the arms, keep your legs out in front of you in a V, straight as possible. I struggle a little bit because of my flexibility, but the Lean Machine guys, no doubt, have the skills and the flexibility to do it properly. Check this out. Okay, the next exercise in conjunction with your V sit-ups is a handstand press-up. Now again, this is something quite difficult to do. It's focusing on strength in your shoulders, some flexibility, some movement, and obviously strength. We're looking to do two to three reps of this, making sure you do it against a wall. If you can do it without a wall, then you're a better man than I am. But go against the wall, look to do three reps. Again, three sets of this. Okay, the very last exercise, if you're still standing, is an ab rollout. Now you can either use a barbell or you can use an ab roller. The focus is to be on your knees, is to get into full extension, so your, your head is right between 
your hands. This focuses on the abs, build good core and stability, which is essential for anything you're trying to do. Right, so I've got to say it goes, my legs are absolutely destroyed. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching us get an absolute high enough, James. We have also done a workout on his channel, JH Bodyfire TV. We, we, we insisted on, we added TV in there for him. So if you want to see that workout, click on John's ugly face, we'll put a square. And if you want to subscribe to James's channel, we're going to put a square on his face. So make sure you check out what we've done because he has beaten us up slightly today. And we will be back this time next week. Love you all and see you soon. Bye guys. Bye bye.